Right, today I'm just doing a few little tweaks as I'm getting ready for the next trip. Excuse the bedding on the table. So, obviously you can see here the situation regarding the bed. It's just a single divan with two drawers. One drawer's taken out because the um, diesel heater is under this side. Not yet made a panel for it to come out of. It's just sat there, but it's fitted and working if need be. And that drawer's got like tools and things in which I need to sort out. Obviously, all this whole structure is temporary to make do so I can afford to do something with it. Now, I've had an issue with the mattress falling off, so I've just screwed a bit of board on the end. It's a bit long, but it'll work. That will stop the mattress falling off that end and leave me with a big gap in the night and losing my pillows. That's the spare mattress from over the cab. So it's doubling up to make a settee back at the moment, but also obviously I've still got it in case I turn over the luton into another bed. And obviously that's also another bed that can go on the floor to sleep somebody else or you know emergency put ups and things like that. Also just quickly screwed um, this bit to the wall to stop it moving because I had that moving and the bed moving every time we were transporting. Not gone too crazy with it. Just a couple of screws just to stabilise it. And that's obviously where I'm carrying my spare water at the moment. Good morning, it is Friday morning, just all locked and loaded, cats are in the back. Hope you're sitting down, spirits having a look, saying what is going on, they sit on the desk I think. Um, it's been raining heavily overnight, um, so I'm hoping my windscreen might push will work, otherwise it's going to be a bit stuck. Hello spirits, and say hello to everybody. And you settle down to bed, good boy. Um, so we're just heading off to Weatherfield now. Um, hopefully it will stop raining and we can get some things sold, but you know, it is what it is, isn't it? At least time and somewhere to park for the weekend is nice. You're a good boy. Yeah, you're a good boy. You'll settle down. So hopefully you won't be screaming at me all this time because I spoke to him then. Hopefully you'll go and settle down. Mischief's already up in bed. She knows what the process is. And um, hopefully he will learn very quickly. Right, we'll catch you later. Bye for now. So we've just arrived and the cats are exploring. Got a lovely spot. Able to uh, get the back down here for selling. And uh, the cat's got a bit of space to walk. Which is absolutely awesome. So they're happy. Uh, got a few people here already. Everybody wave. <coughs> I said to uh, Johnny, I appreciate there's lots of dogs here, but um, he's been set it so obviously. The dogs can be seen near the cats, they can jump in it away, and we're not going to sort of be in the middle of the field and uh, be in an issue. <clears throat> it's just such a lovely place. But yeah, Grace is looking great. The cats are happy. Oh, this is a new one. It's Siggy, is it? Yeah. Siggy's come to say hello to them. Oh, Spirit's seen him. She hasn't done a cat alert before, so I don't know how she's going to behave, so I've got hold of her. <laughs> Good girl, Chief, what's that? It's nice, it's nice, sweeties. Yeah, her tail's gone fluffy. <laughs> it's not going the other way, I'm not sure about that. What's that, Chief? Good girl, cat alert. Yeah. Obviously she has cats going around the, the lorry at home and everything, but like I say, we've not had him come close and it took a week of her hissing at this one to uh, accept, so she will probably defend the lorry, but she might go and say hello. What's that, Chief? <gasps> say hello to Siggy. You going to say hello? No, yeah, I'm too busy washing. He's not bothered by anything. <laughs> He's not bothered. Oh, what's that, darling? Oh, what's oh. she doing? Is she... <clears throat> what's she getting ready for? Yeah, she's um, Yeah. I think it's completely blithely unaware. <laughs> What's that? Good girl. You got a channel? What's your channel, darling? You got a channel? Uh, we're, we're on Instagram. Oh, right. <clears throat> um, and we've got a YouTube channel, but we haven't uploaded yet. Right. So we are CMK Van Life. CMK Van Life. So we'll look for that later. But yeah. And um, I'm oh, known as CMK stands for Catters, Moosey, and Kitten. <laughs> <laughs> I'll put you on the video. Uh, so yeah, I'll get yourself vlogging. That, that's Catters, I'm Moosey, and down the lead there is Kitten. There we go. Um, Give a bit uh, of a vlogging for them. 
And obviously I'm wild cut on the road, because I've got my name well, here. Yeah. yeah, but we are at CMK Van Life on Instagram. Right, I don't um, do Instagram, I got it, but I don't do it, you know. Yeah, it's time, isn't it? Be, we're just growing that channel and we're filming content. Yeah. And then we're going to start, our, our YouTube channel's overdue, actually. Yeah. Um, got to edit the video. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, it's time consuming, it really is. Yeah. Right, yeah. Let, me just, let me just turn this off a minute. It is snoozing time, they are worn out. And if we look this side as well, the little one, bear with me. Absolutely exhausted. Too much exploring outside and watching the people and the dogs have been on high alert. So they're just having a right old snooze now, nice and safe. Right, I have chips here, kindly donated by this wonderful couple who are Roman Max, Roman Max, Max on Instagram and they also gave the cats this lovely fish which I was very jealous over but <laughs> spirit has polished off. <laughs> so there we go and she wasn't interested at all, she threw out the girl hunting. So I have this wonderful portion of chips for dinner tonight so thank you very very much. And you kids have been playing with them haven't you? Who's your mummy and daddy? Thank you, daddy. Who's, who's your mummy and daddy? What do they got a channel? Um, my, my dad has. What's his dad's channel's name? Uh, <gasps> Drew. Who? Drew. Drew. Drew Summit. Drew Summit, or <laughs> Well, Drew's kids have been here playing with the cats, and they've been very, very happy and keeping them company. And they're doing some, just taking spirit off. As you can see, he's seen a dog, and he's learning to come back inside. So he's been very, very good running back into the lorry, aren't you? Quarter past seven. It's getting a bit busy out there now. Drinks are flowing. I can't see back in the Cats refuse to go to sleep, so they are playing now and having an early night as am I who had two school I think she's gone to bed as well the spirit's really really happy and obviously we've got her a longer day tomorrow it's been a long day today so uh, where's she gone? Chee Chief where are you gone? bed's ready to get into I'm gonna go to bed if they're not where's Chee Chief? maybe she's gone into the front is she up there? is she up there? no hunt the cat hunt the cat where's Chee Chief? where is she? <laughs> Where's that cat? Where's Chi Chi gone? I don't know where she is. Anybody see a cat anywhere? Chi Chi Chi! Oh, Spirit's here. Don't know where she is. There she is. She just turned up. Chief, got your dinner? Yeah, what have you been doing? Where have you been hiding? Hey, whoops. You're all tired, aren't you? What? You, you can watch them out the window, can't you? So much going on, you don't want to miss out, do you? I just had a little walk, so I'll go through another walk later. There's too much going on, it's going to get busier so she can watch from there. What's out there? Hey, good girl. I know what you feel like. You want to watch it and not go to sleep, don't you? You can see everything that's going on. The spirits has been absolutely fabulous. Oh, I also had another donation of food. What we got from here? From a... Uh, Got his name, the coffee, coffee on the bike guy. <laughs> um, we've got Rice Krispies, some oat milk, which I've got to try, and a melon. So I've got to try that for some cereal later. So I've been fed today, which is lovely. Like this is <laughs> the leftover was me trying to cut up a chicken that wasn't cooked. So I managed to get the legs and the wings off, and I made and I bought that with some potatoes for dinner today. Um, I've got to try and cook that up next. Um, <laughs> no, and I didn't bring my big, big sauce pot. Hello, you got a bed now? She's waiting for me to come in here. 
And what are you doing under there? Don't you go do any notices under there? And the poop is under there. Right, chief bed. You go kill. Bedtime. Bedtime. We've got to be have these this door down at nine in the morning, don't we? And get this bring in body stuff on the go. So we we'll rest now. And then we've got to get all this sorted for the morning. But the selling area is right in front of us. So that's all good. Say night night, Chief. Good girl. Good girl.